guys and welcome back to my channel this is the airplane style for my returning subscribers you are welcome and for my new subscribers you are welcome and for you they are going to subscribe to my video uh, to my channel because of this video you are welcome also so in today's video i want to show you how to style this frontal lace wig yes without using blue or anything so now let's just go right straight into the video so this is the hair. I am a tanga. <laughs> so this is the hair, guys. Let's go straight. And um, I'm not actually doing it on my head, but I just want to get this hair cut. I think you understand what I'm saying. I just want to get this hair cut on my head before I transfer this on a mannequin head. So let's go. So because I'll be doing this on the mannequin head, not on my head. So let's just get this ear cut. This ear cut. That's what I'm guys after getting the haircut so i just went ahead and um, attached this band to it so i'll be attaching the band from the first side of the haircut to the second side of the haircut so guys this is when i've added the um band to it so i'll go ahead and start standing the hair you can see i join joined the band from the first haircut to the second Air cut. So now I'm placing the air on this uh, canvas head. So I'll just go ahead and cut the essence net at the front, like the way you are seeing it right on the screen. So I'm placing your cut to make sure you are very careful, so you won't cut out the um, you won't cut the air out. So just make sure you are careful when you are cutting the um net. So once again, this is Elbony Star for my returning subscribers. You're welcome. My new subscribers, you're welcome. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. So this is when I was picking out the um the edges, like the hair I'm going to use for the edges. So this is when I was picking it out of the hair. So now guys I just went ahead and start styling the weave on. So yeah, I'm just using my straightener to straighten this air. So I want it straight. I'm giving it a straight and a curve shape at the front side. So yeah, I'm just straightening it using my um straightener to st straight it. So keep watching guys. So when I 
I get to the front that I actually I'm supposed to have done this before even starting if before I even start um straightening on anything so I just forgot so when I reached the front side that's where I remember that so I just went ahead and removed the um wig from the canvas head and apply some foundation on that particular net side i hope you understand what i'm saying this particular net side it is fucking is white ah and i've said I'll, I'll stop using fucking i don't know <laughs> so this is when i was applying it to the yes i use brush and this foundation brush so i use it to i use it to um to paint that side yes i use it to paint that. and yeah i use my blue dryer to blow it so that it will be um it will, it will get dry on time because i'm placing it back on that canvas head to continue straightening the wig so that's the reason why i'm using a blue dryer to blow it so that it will get dry before i place it back on it so i place it back on the cap and then i'll just go ahead and start using my straight not to straighten this um to straighten this hair and actually the reason why i use i'm using a canvas head is because i want it to be more explanatory than using my head yes i'm supposed to use, actually use my head for this video so that you will get but i want it to get small that's why i i did use my canvas head for the video so yeah i was applying this wax yes the wax is sold for i think 2000 era as at when i bought it but now i don't know so then it was 2k but now i don't know i can't say so i just keep it adding the wax and the essence of adding the water that the hair will stay it's give you the style you want and all oh, that's why i was adding at um wax and then i'm taking the front of air little by little and then when i went to add the most just give me this perfect um this that i want yes so i wanted to give me the perfect um shape i am uh, perfect i want that i added mousse and i added wax also and then i'll go ahead and use my hot comb again to comb this air to give me the look i want so that's what i kept I place this wig on my hair just to get this um the baby hair shape to get the edges shape so that's why I placed it so I added this and then I went on and draw the edges you can go for any style you want yes so I went for the style I want and I just did the edges just at the side part not the full edges yes so I just I did mine I did mine my edges <laughs> i did my baby okay let me just be like that so i did my edges i was not really getting that it is very red it actually gave me a um hard time because i was not getting it i was just comping and doing it comping and getting it you know just give it time you are going to get it so now i just wrap some band on the air so that it will stick and then i use some blue dryer to put it off so that's just to give me um so that it's going to get dry on time so i use a blue dry for the hair to get dry on time so that's what i was doing yeah and i can actually leave it to get dry naturally but i was in the haze to get the final look so i cannot even wait so now i'll just go ahead and untie the band and boom hey power look at my head is that so <laughs> Wow, and you say ah oh for the other doll <laughs> glueless front uh, yes i'm saying it this is a glueless front uh. actually this is my first time trying a front uh. yeah so that's why it's looking rough and it's not looking perfect so guys rate me in the comment section tell me what you feel 
and tell me I'm doing great or not. <laughs> so this is my, my first time actually, so don't, don't judge me any else. So this is when I place it back on the canvas and I forgot to do a video. So this is it. Sha. So thank you for watching, for my returning subscriber, mwah, my new subscriber, mwah, for everybody that is watching my video. Mwah. So make sure you like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in my next video and make sure you turn on the notification bell so that you're going to see the next thing I'm going to bring up to you. Because this year, say, I'm not, uh, I, I must get monetized with yes. So guys, see you guys in my, um, in my next video. Coming up in this next Tuesday. Bye-bye.